What's happening, good people? Today, this one is especially for my UK peeps out there. Don't say I don't take care of you guys. I ordered a guitar specifically for my European connection. The Fender Squire Debut Telecaster. Who knew these were out here? It's kind of shocking how few uh, reviews there are on this thing because it doesn't seem like it's very well known. Obviously not in the uh, states over here because we can't get it. I actually had to go on to not only the Amazon UK, I had to go to the German Amazon and go through that route and order it because every time I tried to order it through the UK, it would tell me it would have taken till like September. So I went to Germany's Amazon. Hey, what's happening everybody? I just wanna let you know that in case if you are in the US and you're trying to order from an overseas Amazon, you're gonna to wanna to stick around to the end for a little bit of a cautionary tale. All right, let's get back to it. I was able to get only the Burst model and it came relatively quick, actually uh, a week before I was supposed to. But unfortunately, it is going back because that long shipping just means extra time for somebody to kick it around. And unfortunately, we got little dents and dings and it's peeling off, so. But maybe if it's good enough, I might order it again. Something that's kind of unique. It still is the cheapest Telecaster that you can get in the States by a little bit. Because if you haven't ordered a thing from overseas, if you haven't done the Harley Benton thing yet, which I really would love to do, when you order something, it gets an exorbitant amount of tax on it. And I believe it's the same vice versa. So this was, it should have been like $129 US, I believe when you do the conversion rates, but it was close to about $200. And I'll put everything up on the screen for you, broken, broken down for how much it would be for our overseas friends and for how much it would be for, for us. But this probably is more of a dedicated view to our overseas viewers across the pond. I guess you could say that I'm thinking globally here instead of just locally. You're welcome. Out of the box, it was the typical, you know, Squire debut wrapped up and we'll uh, have a short to speed up the process here. And it'll be linked in a, in a video description later that you could see the unboxing part of it. The box actually wasn't really that damaged. So I was kind of surprised when I had the damage over here. Uh, we'll give you close-ups too of it, but the switching seemed like it's okay. And I'm not sure if the, the knobs are messed up from it being bounced around or if it's grinding on the chrome plate right here. But when you turn it, I'll put it right up to the microphone. Watch your ears. Don't know how this is gonna sound. A little scratchy. And I think that might just been from it being bounced around. I'm not really sure if that's the way it normally comes. But other than that, the nut looks pretty good. The um, string tree, your standard single string tree. And yeah, not much to it. Same things with as the Stratocaster model. You get the 30 days of uh, the Fender Play free. I'll just plug it in, give you some tones, and then uh, We'll also give you a close-up on this thing. Do a quick quick little tune-up. And you know I usually like to take this time to uh, let you guys know that most of you are actually watching this. You're not subscribed to the channel. So being that I did this one for you, especially the UK peoples, you should hit that subscribe button. Obviously, I bought this with my own money. So this is an unbiased and review that is unsponsored, unpaid for, and the opinions are my own. Just like every other review though, let's get at it.
Sounds like something wrong with the uh, bridge pickup over here. Not really sure if it's uh, the way they always are or they messed it up in the shipping. Well, we got the blues driver on the floor. We'll see uh, when we get to the bridge pickup if it does anything better. I think the uh, bridge pickup in this thing is completely shot. Well, that was a major bust. The uh, bridge pickup, kaputz. I don't know if that's a German word, but since I got it from uh, uh, Germany, I guess maybe that's pretty fitting. I guess it kind of owes us to uh, maybe see if we can get one again and try to do a uh, redo of this video. Hey everyone. So this wasn't originally a part of the video because I wasn't sure if I was going to do it, but I ran up ordering the guitar again from uh, Amazon Germany. So hopefully it'll be coming soon and we'll do another review on that. But as I mentioned earlier on, I'm not sure if it goes vice versa, but at least ordering from the US to Germany's Amazon, when you do the return, you actually don't get a free return label. What they claim is that they reimburse you after they receive it. And it takes almost 30 days from the time of receipt to you submitting it seems like it's such a long time. So this might not be an avenue for you because it's up to you to go find the cheapest shipping that you can. They claim that they'll pay it no matter what because at first I found out it would have cost me about $400 to ship through UPS. And I wound up doing my due diligence in case I have to eat this money. And it wound up being that through the United States Postal Service, it was only about $170. So it's kind of crazy to think that I could possibly be out a total of $199 for the guitar that I'm about to order and another $170 to ship back the one that they gave me. It's going to cost a pretty sane amount of money. So look at me. I'm sticking my neck out for you. Like I said before, you should hit that subscribe button. There's even more of a reason for you to do that. Kind of put it on everybody's radar. If you are looking for a uh, Squire... Telecaster debut. Sorry for all my European friends out there. I tried. I was thinking globally, had you guys in mind, and went out and all this effort to try to get this thing. What a letdown. Thank you for uh, tuning in for this depressing guitar review. Hopefully the rest of them from now on go much better. You've all been a fantastic audience, and as always, stay tuned. Mm -hmm.